once upon a time in a fairy land long, long ago, there lived a beautiful young transvestite named Tick Tick Kaboom. Now, Tick Tick was a very special transvestite because she had a magical asshole. And it was said that all that touched it would turn to gold. In the same land, there also lived a mean, horrible, ugly lesbian named Spike. Now, Spike was a hateful soul who spent her entire life welding cars, trucks, and motorbikes. One day, Tick Tick was out in the backyard working in her flower garden when a horrible loud roar was heard from the street in front of her house. So Tick Tick went around to see what all the commotion was about. The loud noise was coming from a Harley Davidson motorcycle and mounted atop the large machine was Spike the Dyke, welder of cars, trucks, and motorbikes. As soon as Spike's eyes gazed upon the beautiful Tick Tick, the burly lesbian knew she was in love. Unknowing to Spike that the lovely Tick Tick was a transvestigator, Spike crawled off the bike and went over to her, the fair maiden Kaboom. Yo, man, Spike growled in a low and manly burly voice. Why, hello, said the lovely Tick Tick. You know, you're about the most beautiful creature I've ever seen. Why, thank you, but you know, things are always what they seem. At this time, Spike the Dyke, welder of cars, trucks, and motorbikes, invited Tick Tick to go on a lesbonic joyride on the mighty sickle. So they mounted the monster and rode into the afternoon with a smile. After a long ride into the country, Spike steered the mighty sickle onto a large patch of woods, and as they rode further back into the dark and dreary woodlands, the meek and mild Tick Tick became so afraid and began to shake. Yeah, she shook. At this time, the mighty lesbian pulled the bike between two trees and yanked Tick Tick off the sickle and threw her to the ground. Tick Tick screamed to the top of her lungs, What the fuck is going on here? Fuck is exactly what's fixing to happen, said Spike the Dyke, welder of cars, trucks, and motorbikes. At that time, the manly, monstrous lesbian reached into her leather jacket and pulled out a huge 12-inch double-headed dildo and said, Get prepared to ride the donkey, bitch. So Spike the Dyke, welder of cars, trucks, and motorbikes, ripped away Tick Tick's pink polka dotted poodle skirt to reveal a large patch of silver duct tape. What the hell is this? Yelled the hateful bulldagger. Poor Tick Tick cried, It's my silver pussy! And I'm really Buford Bubba Bodinsky from Beaumont, Texas, and I'm a living, breathing transvestite. Well, in her mighty fury, Spike started to shove the double headed 12 inch dildo up Tick Tick's ass, but as soon as it touched the puttered hole, the magical asshole turned the dildo into a large golden wand. And at the same time, the huge crash of thunder and a puff of smoke, and there stood the most handsome homo in all the land. And he said, Spike the dyke, be gone. You have no power here. Be gone for some dyke drops a truck on you. And poof, she was cast to the bull dagger dungeon. The handsome fag took Tick Tick by the hand and they flew off to fairy heaven and lived happily ever after. <laughs> Come down on Marcella Garcia! <laughs> Girl, Madonna wishes.